Welcome to our lecture online. Our next problem is kind of an interesting problem. Let's read it together. We have a farmer's orchard that has 20 trees per acre and they produce 50 bushels of fruit per tree. Now the question is, for each tree added per acre, the trees produce one less bushel. How many trees should be added to produce 1104 bushels per acre? So let's find out how many bushels the farmer produces now without changing any number of trees. So we can say that the number of bushels produced will be equal to the number of trees multiplied times the number of bushels per tree. So you can see that if we multiply the number of trees by the number of bushels per tree, we should get the total number of bushels. And that would be the bushels is equal to the number of trees, which was 50. Well, not 50. We have 20 trees per acre. So let's change that. 20 trees per acre times the number of bushels per tree. That's 50. That gives us 1,000 bushels produced for each acre of trees. Now we want to increase that to 1,104 bushels. So we can do that by adding more trees. Of course, when we add more trees, then each tree will produce less bushels. So we can see here that if x equal the number of added trees, then the new number of bushels produced will be equal to the number of trees, will now be 20 plus x, because now we have this many trees per acre. And we want to multiply that times the number of bushels per tree, which now will be 50 minus x. And of course, the total number of bushels now will have to be 1104. So 1104 is equal to this product, which would be 20 times 50, which is 1,000. 20 times minus x is minus 20x. x times 50 is plus 50x. And x times the minus x is minus x squared. Combining these ter two terms, we have 1,104 is equal to 1,000 plus 30x plus x squared. And now we're going to move everything over to one side. Hey, let's see here, that's not a plus, that's a minus. So now we move it across, now it becomes plus x squared minus 30x plus 1104 minus 1000 equals zero. And combining those two, we get x squared minus 30x plus 104 equals zero. And now we have a quadratic equation in its regular format, standard format. Now we can factor that equals zero. We're going to need an x and an x. Both numbers are going to be, need to be negative because when we multiply we get a positive, when we add them we get negative. So we have a negative and a negative. Now we're looking for two numbers. When we multiply we get 104. When we add them we get minus 30. Now 4 times 25 is 100, but 4 and 25 adds up to 29. But 4 times 26 is 104, and add those two together, that gives us 30. So 4 and 26 will work. Now, that means if we multiply two binomials, we get 0, that either the first one is equal to 0, or the second one is equal to 0, which means that either x equals 4 or x equals 26. Now, let's see which of these will give us the correct solution. If we have four more trees, then the number of bushels produced is going to be 20 plus 4. And each, each tree will then produce four less bushels, which is 50 minus 4. And so that will be 24 times 46. And let's see, that's 29, 20. Yes, that will be indeed 1104 bushels. So that will work. That will give us the correct answer. What about 26? So the number of bushels will be equal to, uh, number of uh, bushels will be 20 plus 26 trees. But now we have 50 minus 26 bushels. That will be 46 multiplied times, mm, let's see here, 24. Notice we get the same product. So again, that will be 1104. So either way, we'll produce 1104 bushels, either by adding four trees or by adding 26 trees. Now, if you're going to produce the same number of bushels and you only need to add four trees instead of 26, I would prefer this solution. So I would recommend the farmer, if he wants to produce 1104 bushels, to add four trees per acre. And that is how it's done.